Today we're going to take apart an iPhone. I'm going to show you how to take off and replace the screen in three minutes. Uh, to start off with, you grab your little star screwdriver and there's two screws right next to the charging port. So unscrew each of those. It's the same size of screwdriver that you would have used with your iPhone 4 or 4S. Once those are out, grab a little suction cup. Um, the bigger the suction cup, the better. And then uh, you just have to pry off the bottom of the screen. In hindsight, I probably should use a plastic tool, uh, so keep that in mind. There's a ribbon cables up along the top, so be very careful when you're pulling it away, because if you damage those ribbon cables, especially on your new screen, then you'll have some problems. There's three little screws right here that you have to take out to unplug the ribbon cables from the phone. And I'll show you those. This little bracket comes right off as soon as you get the three screws undone. Doing the iPhone 5 screen is much easier than doing the iPhone 4 or 4S screens. To replace the screen you have to do undo about 30 screws. The little bracket just slid right off. And then as far as the, uh, the flex cables go, um, you just pop them off with a flat tool. They're just like little snaps, kind of like Legos. So there's two of them right there and then the third one's underneath and that releases the screen. So take the get rid of your old screen and put your new screen on. Just grabbing each little flex cable just like you would with the Lego and just placing them down into place and snapping them in. Once I got them all placed down I just use my finger to just give them one little more push just to make sure they're all connected. Keep in mind that these screws are also different sizes. The two bottom screws are the same size, but the top screw is a little bit longer. I'm going to speed this up a little bit just because the screws were hard to get into place. There we go. When you're putting the top back on, make sure you uh, slide the top in first, and then you can take the phone down the sides and clip it all into place. After you're done and it's all back in place, you can put the bottom two star screws in. And there you go. If you have any questions, make sure to leave them in the comments. Uh, don't forget to like if this helped you, and don't forget to subscribe.